how your trading psychology and habits are affecting your results. I had bad habits when I started and I missed out on $6.4 million in profits on an investment that only cost me about 15 grand. And I've been learning ever since. I've created this channel to share knowledge so you don't make the same mistakes that I did. One of the biggest reasons people have poor results is because of their trading psychology, which in turn affects their habits. Let me say that again. Our psychology affects how we behave. Your emotional relationship with money affects your subconscious before you even start trading. How your family views money, money habits you have seen common in others affects you. Does your family invest or do they save? Do they spend a lot? All of this matters. Here are the fears and habits we need to be aware of. Fear of missing out, also known as FOMO. Fear of loss. Fear of being wrong. Fear of taking profits too early or missing out on greater profits. Greed or being too aggressive. Over trading or trading too many underlyings. Revenge trading, especially after losses. Being aware of these fears and subconscious influences helps us defeat them. The way we improve our trading psychology is by pre-planning our habits before we trade. Avoid emotions by pre-planning actions. By pre-planning and having a trading plan, we are removing the emotions beforehand. While trading under stress, if you stick to your plan, you will have better results. Treat trading like a business. Using knowledge and deliberate habits is the way to operate. Here are some habits for success. Have a clear trading plan. A clear reason to get in or get out. Stick to your plan. Accept losses. Losses are part of the business. Have a fixed, predetermined amount of risk, like 2% of your account. Have a predetermined take profit, like two times that risk. Journal and track the results of each trade. If you measure it, you can improve it. Lastly, I like to have rituals for winning to reinforce the behavior. Have a routine for both good days and bad days to rebalance and reflect. When I win, I pay myself and I do something positive to make the winning real. It can be make a payment or add to a savings account that earns interest. When I lose, I reflect on my mechanical habits, reflect on whether any adjustments need to be made. I hope you found this useful, and if you received value, consider supporting the channel with a like and a subscribe. Cheers.